Okay, so let's solve this problem. Determine the resultant moment of the four forces acting on the rod shown about point O. So this is point O. So makita natin, meron tayong four forces. 50, kilo, 50 newtons, 60 newtons, 20 newtons, and 40 newtons. So hinahanap is resultant moment. So let's say the resultant moment is um, M sub R about point O. So this is equal to the of course, meron tayong forces, so summation of forces, since moment siya, yung force meron siyang moment arm or perpendicular distance doon sa point. So, FT. So, lagay tayo ng sign, let's say positive, counterclockwise. Okay. So, resultant moment, about point O is equal to, so, so hanapin natin, so this one of force is in 50 newtons. So, itong 15 newtons, um, meron siyang perpendicular distance or moment arm about 0.0 na 2 meters. Ayan. So, imagine natin, iikot siya ganito. Anong direction nito? This is clockwise. So, maging negative. So, negative 50 times moment arm which is 2. So, next is 60 newtons. So, itong 60 newtons, um, Ano yung ano niya? Distance niya sa point O. Perpendicular distance. Zero. Bakit? Kasi titingnan natin dito, ano siya? Directly towards or away. Away sa point O. So, wala siyang perpendicular distance. So, hindi siya nag, ano ng moment sa point O. So, let's say plus 60 times zero. Okay? Then, next is yung um, point, I mean, for 60 newtons. Ay, 20 newtons rather. So, 20 newtons. So, ano yung kanyang perpendicular distance sa point O? So, ang mo, kung dito papunta yung 20 newtons, papunta dito, ang distance niya is ito. Yan yung perpendicular distance niya, yung moment arm niya. So, paano ito masolve? So, meron tayong, um, dito makikita natin, meron tayong triangle na mabubuo. So, ito yung triangle. So, drawing ko muna. So, parang ganyan. Ayan. So, this is 3 meters daw. Yung hypotenuse. Then, meron tayong um, 30 degrees dito na angle. So, this is 30 degrees. So, um, 30, 60, 90 um, triangle. Um, I-rule natin. So, kung 3 meters to, ang, ang side um, opposite side sa angle na to, yung corresponding side sa angle 30 degrees is 1 half, so this is 1.5 meters so, ang moment arm nito, ng 20 newtons is, this one is 1.5 meters, okay so, kung iikot siya na pa ganun, diba, this is clockwise, I mean counterclockwise so, positive so, plus 20 newtons times 1.5 meters and lastly, itong um 40 newtons so anong moment arm niya so this one yan okay so ito given na agad to na four, 2 plus 2 is 4 so 4 meters to meron tayo dito 4 meters then meron pa tayong distance dito itong hanapin natin to so this is the adjacent side dito yan okay so Kung 30 degrees yan, this is 60 degrees. So, ano yung side na uh, opposite sa 60 degrees? Sa 30, 60, 90, this is 1.5 times the square root of 3. Diba? So, iikot siya pag ganun. This is clockwise, negative. So, minus 40 times moment arm. Kung 1.5 ito, this one, 1.5 square root of 3. So, pa-plus lang natin sa 4. So, plus, 4 plus 1.5 square root of 3. Okay. So, resultant moment natin. Sorry. O is equal to, calculator lang. O sige, simplify natin sa isa. Negative 100. Plus, this one is 30. Then minus um, 4 plus, plus 1.5 square root of 3 is 40. 
this is negative 263.92 so simplify again is equal to 71 minus 100 plus 30 so the answer is negative 333.92 newtons so since negative siya positive is counterclockwise ang ikot niya is clockwise so ang resultant moment natin about point o is 333.92 newtons clockwise so this is the answer